me. Can you hear it? He tells me to embrace the darkness and put on the mask. My brother, his voice echoed through my mind, compelling me to embrace the shadows. It feels like a never-ending nightmare you can't wake from. And I can't make it stop. I've tried to ignore it. The carnival, the man standing in a burlap mask, invaded my dreams. And with each awakening, I felt the weight of madness upon me. It feels like when I wear the mask, Ray is taking over me. His thoughts become mine. He left us without saying goodbye. I want him to come back so bad, but, but I know it can't happen. He would always tell me to embrace it, don't run from it. He will always find you. Please answer me, Bray. I need you, brother, please come home. I have to do this, this is a part of mine and his legacy. Our name, our fireflies are hungry. I must feed the fireflies. The carnival awaits us. Our actions are not mere disruptions. We are the overture to a symphony of chaos that will engulf the very fabric of the WWE. We have a mission to finish what Bray started. The carnival of chaos unfolds. Why at six we are the architects of Bray's legacy. Our presence will be felt and those who stand in the way will tremble in the face of our orchestrated pandemonium. This isn't just my story. It's the tale of a man entangled in the web of his brother's malevolent design. Bray Wyatt's influence will shape the very fabric of me, and through Wormwood, his narrative will persist casting a shadow over the wrestling world. Follow the darkness, or the darkness will follow you.